Hi, I'm Nerida Conway and welcome to ChefMasterclasses.com. Now, in addition to the fabulous work that you're seeing from our fantastic chefs, we have had some emails from people asking us for some easy, family-friendly recipes that you can whip up that everyone's going to love in your family. And I've got a perfect one that's simple as can be using products that you would find in your pantry. Jam, not just to put on toast. Now I'm making sticky apricot chicken drumsticks and the good thing is that you can serve them warm for dinner midweek or you can pop them into the fridge when you're done and have them in the kids lunch boxes for school the next day. They're also great to make ahead and take on a picnic. Okay so I've got a quarter of a cup of chicken stock here in my bowl and very simply to that I'm going to add a teaspoon of Dijon mustard. Now this is Dijon grainy mustard just for a bit of texture but any sort of mustard is actually fine a teaspoon of finely grated garlic. I've got some IXL apricot conserve, which would be perfect for this. Popping in three tablespoons of this. As you know, apricots and chicken go beautifully together. Now I'm just gonna whisk it up. And the good thing about the jam is that as it breaks down and we sort of spread it onto our chicken as a glaze, it makes the chicken really golden and beautiful and caramelizes so nicely and leaves it a really sticky, sweet, lovely flavour. So to prepare our chicken, I've just got a baking dish here and I've lined it with some baking paper inside just to clean, just because I'm beats the heck out of scrubbing the dish at the end. I can just lift off the paper. And I've got a cake wire cooling rack, which I'm just popping on top. And I just place my chicken drumsticks on here. And I'm just going to brush the glaze on top of these drumsticks, pop them into the oven on about 150 degrees for about 20 minutes. Now, at about the 10 minute mark, I'm going to just give them another layer of the glaze just to make sure that they sort of really become lovely and sticky and caramelised. Be generous with this glaze. How simple is that? Now I'm just going to pop them into the oven. So they really smell and look delicious. Everyone's going to love these. And I'm going to serve them with some steamed rice and some green beans. But just to add a little bit of excitement to my steamed rice, I found this beautiful little pot here of baby rocket, believe it or not. It's a very peppery, lovely flavour. It'll just give it a bit of a kick. And just sprinkle it in through my rice. To be even doubly fancy, I've got some ginger marmalade here. This is actually very, very sweet. It's got a very faint hint of ginger through it, but it's just going to add volumes to this. So I'm just going to pop a little bit here on the side of the plate. And this really just forms a bit of a dipping sauce for our chicken drumsticks. And here's my Wednesday night dinner that I know I'm going to have no complaints about. Thank you.